Good afternoon, Mid-Michigan. I'm meteorologist Jake DeReese. We had a pretty eventful night last night, especially in Mid-Michigan, for a late February date. I mean, we saw some severe weather last night that is waiting to be confirmed on our scales, especially with those tornado reports. We're going to break it all down for you, though, right now. This is our current satellite and radar right now, which is showing some lake effect off of Lake Michigan for our counties over on the west side of the state. Some of this could reach Lansing, but it shouldn't be too impactful should just be some flurries. Our main impacts today, our winds. But let's talk about what we saw yesterday. This is our 48-hour rain accumulation. Yes, rain, not snow. Usually snow is what we do see in February, but we did see some changes last night. And areas in green, I mean, look at that right now, accumulation in areas just south of Lansing saw 2.3 inches of rain. That is already over the average in February because rain is not the main precipitation type we see this month. All the other areas in blue saw different amounts. So let me go and show you some other amounts throughout the area. Let me show you what Lansing actually got. And let me click on that. Lansing only got about eight tenths of an inch, but that is still a lot considering we only had about three tenths of an inch for the whole month so far. And we are only in the final days of this. Over in the areas where we saw some of those tornadoes in Calhoun, let's take a look over there. About an inch and a half of rain. Those green areas are indicating that we saw more rainfall in those areas than the blue, and we can also see some of our neighborhoods in the south didn't see much at all. This was definitely an event that had its main track through the area and also didn't bring much to anyone in those southern counties. I mean, they were warned. There were some warnings, watches and warnings last night. But again, as you can see, all of that just clearness right now, just some sprinkles in some of those southern counties for us. Mainly, though, we get a good track of where those warnings, especially the tornado warnings and the severe thunderstorm warnings. Next, I want to take a look at some of our storm reports that we saw throughout the day. This is a more zoomed in look at some of our areas. And right now this is in this storm report right here is actually a tornado um, report that came in from spotters as well as radar confirmed and also got the 911 service director involved as well. Right now we are waiting for damage crews to get out there so we can get any type of confirmation on this. But right now that is a report we saw last night in Calhoun County with a bunch of surrounding it to the west. Some hail reports as well. And I know some hail in Battle Creek got up to 1.75 inches. And we also saw a hail report even here in Lansing. Now another tornado report was over in Genesee County overnight as well, which was also, I mean, very rare to see any um, tornado, tornadic activity that we are waiting, of course, for confirmation on, but in our area, especially for February. And again, February rainfall, we only have observed before this event 0.3 inches about of rainfall, which the normal is 1.71 inches. And we are still so below on snowfall that we're definitely at this point not going to make it over that um, middle part for snow. But again, we did get close to rain, so it was a very, very dry um, February for us. Very not winter-like, but it did turn out to produce somewhat of an event that, of course, we are waiting on confirmation for. But make sure you're sticking around on our website to see more updates on what this caused for our neighborhoods.